Yo, good morning, Raptoria. Hello, everybody. Welcome, welcome. Good to see you all here. Darkest Dungeon 2. It's out today, finally, in full, like, the full release of the game out on Steam. It hasn't been on Steam before, but today, in just a few hours, it'll be out on Steam. So it's a new Steam game that you can get. Uh, it's been on Epic Game Store, I think, since 2021, question mark? It's been around on Epic for a while. It's not a new game by any means, but it is new to Steam and it is a new release. The full game comes out in just a little bit. So uh, this morning we're going to take a look at it on Epic as the Steam version has not yet dropped. So what we'll do is we'll play the early access version of this until it comes out in just a couple hours and then we'll uh, go ahead and fire up the full version of the game as it drops on Steam and fully releases on Epic. And then we'll play like the full game, the complete game. We'll uh, chalk this up to being like a little practice run. Oh, yeah. Darkest Dungeon was cool. I really liked that game. I thought it was really cool. And we played uh, Darkest Dungeon 2 for the first time a little while ago when Darkest Dungeon 2 first came to Epic. And now with it fully releasing, I figured we would play a little bit of the early, early release version and then play the full version once it drops. Bum, bum. Oh boy. Darkest Dungeon is about making the most of a bad situation. You're not expected to succeed on your first expedition or even your tenth. Heroes will die, failure will abound, and the world will seek to smother your flame. Take heart, don't relent, press forward through the encroaching gloom gloom, and face your fears. Redemption at last can be found deep within the icy depths of the... Darkest Dungeon! <laughs> cool. Nice. Two. Darkest Dungeon 2. Cool. Let's get started. Let's get it. This game is dark and gritty, and uh, I've mentioned Darkest Dungeon a few times when we played some other games where it, it kind of channels this whole dark energy. Dark, gritty, broken, disease, decay, rust, rot, failure. A lot of games that channel this energy. Ruin has found you at last. My protege, my friend. Our calculations were correct. The ephemeral equation is unbalanced. The Earth spins on a strange and terrifying new axis. And everywhere, unbridled consequence. The world is a wasteland of failures past. And yet, you must ride out into it. Unafraid. Take this. It is hope. The very last of it. It is yours now. You were bold once. Be bold once more. Free yourself from this suffocating stillness. Fix your gaze on the horizon. And face the fearsome truth of the darkest dungeon. Wow. So we're the last hope of some sort. Pretty sure this is like a direct sequel, too. Uh, like the narrator is the narrator is so good for Darkest Dungeon. The seat of your denial. Perched precariously in the murky gloaming. Ew. Complete your confession. Well, there's only one to choose, so denial? That's a river. The shackles of denial must be destroyed.
Also, devs, please put options on the main menu. I can't tell you how many times <laughs> a game starts and they don't like they want to hide the options menu. Like it goes into a cutscene and then you're in the game and the music's blaring and it's like, oh, to go, oh, dude, you want to go to the uh, the options menu? Oh, I guess that's the first thing I want to do. Usually. Oh, this is cool. It shows you everything that uh, these symbols mean. Now, I haven't played this much, Darkest Dungeon or Darkest Dungeon 2, so this is going to be a full de-rusting. I wasn't even that good to begin with, but the game's not supposed to be easy anyway, so it's not like you could tell. Will it be dark by any chance? I think so, yeah. Oh wow, there's a lot of... A lot of tutorial. But I remember quite a bit of it. But not everything. Especially about the combat. I remember our first meeting on the steps of the university. Collegial handshake that would doom us both. Yes, yeah, cool. Your insightful questions during my lectures gave me pause, and I recognized in you something of a kindred spirit. Despite our differences in age and position, we shared a keen fascination for archaeology, folklore, and, of course, occultism. Oh, of course, you know, as as one would naturally do. The crossroads, a beacon for the broken and the battered. Already? Uh, failure, regret, disgrace, loathing, guilt. Lovely. Oh, I think we get to name our characters. Yeah. Cool. So we have our warrior. We have a plague doctor, a grave robber, a highwayman, and a man at arms. Hmm. Oh, we can unlock more characters at the Altar of Hope. And we can also do a random party, but this is fine for now. Oh, they each have an individual party goal, too. Visit a field hospital, enter a shroud. Hmm. Advance low. Hmm, let's see. Oh. Well, we can't fit the whole name. Crispy Bako. <laughs> Big O Bako. Alright, that's as many letters as we can fit. Hopefully nobody dies after I name them after people of chat. All right, who wants to be our plague doctor? Raptor never played this game. Art style, atmosphere are cool. The narrator voice is epic. Yeah, the narrator is like the best part. Like whenever I hear this guy's voice, I've heard him in like maybe a couple other games. I'm always like, the hell is dark? Is this darkest dungeon? Like I, I don't even think of this guy's voice as being a part of any other game. He, th this, this guy makes Darkest Dungeon. Like, his narration is so damn good. We've also played a few other games on the channel that are like Darkest Dungeon. Like there was one called the, um, um, it was a a circus one. Like it was called a Cir Circus Electric or something like that. And um, 
you would you would manage like a freak show in a circus, but then also you would do combat like it was Darkest Dungeon. These these games are really cool. Uh, a lot of people love these like turn-based combat uh, games that are they almost feel like card games, but you know they're not. Yeah, that game was badass. Yeah, any of these Darkest like games, I'm sure this Darkest Dungeon probably takes from some other games too. But like Darkest Dungeon is at least the biggest new game that I could think of where it's like there's other games that were inspired by the original and new ones that are coming out now so but uh, if you got more to suggest like DM me because I, I love these types of games let's do uh, you know we're gonna just do this one all right let's do another one Uh, finally, we can fit a whole game, a name in the uh, in the game. <laughs> they only give you like ten uh, characters or whatever to t type a name in. Okay, let's start figuring out who's who. What is a physician if not a student of decay? Skills, info, past story, quirks. Oh, are these items? Oh yeah. Oh right, right. Dude, the artwork here is so damn good. This game and Dark and Darker also give me the same vibe, even though they look completely Remember, different. Welcome. Melophobic? Music is the trigger for deep-seated resentment. Oh. Hates music. Okay. Blood, blight, burn, stun. This is like advanced stuff. Obviously we're going to die on our first run, so. Torn rotator cuff. Oh, Tan was out playing some baseball. <laughs> so this is like a positive trait and like a negative trait. Like good reflexes, but he's a he's hemo he's a hemophiliac. So, uh, blood. What is that? Less resistance to bleeding. Bum leg and a gaunt hater. I'm assuming if you roll the characters, that they'll probably give different plus and minus buff and debuffs. So, all right. Let's go. How do we, uh, how do we go? I think everybody's good. Oh, yeah, these are the abilities, too. We can unlock those over time. So this is who we're going with. Yeah, I don't know. That guy's resistance is like... I think his resistance is to, like... He's resistant to... Making others bleed? I don't I don't know what that means. Like, of his, of his abilities, he's got like a 0% chance to make other characters bleed, I think. I don't know. Okay. I, I want to go. So do we, like, click and drag these people here? Oh yeah, okay. Indiscriminate science stains the surgeon's hands. Well, that's kind of cool. You can like create a, you can create characters and then maybe have them save here and then use them later. It's kind of cool. You can set everything up ahead of time for other games, maybe. The valley. Onward, and let us hope enough yet remains of the world. Okay, so before we get started, I just want to let everybody in chat know that, again, we are playing, like, the... This is still the early access version that's... I'm playing this on the Epic Game Store at the moment, but the Steam version should come out in, like, an hour or two, or maybe three, who knows, Steam, but it will be out today. So in about two or three hours, this game will update to the full release, so it'll be a new... It'll be a new game on Steam, like it's never been on Steam before. Uh, because it was an Epic Game Store exclusive. So when it drops on Steam, it will be like the full-priced, full-release version of the game. Uh, but it could still be on sale on the Epic Game Store, especially if you've got like some coupons or whatnot from previous uh, Epic Game Store sales. 
So if you want to get Darkest Dungeon 2, if you buy it now, it'll be early access only on Epic, but in a couple hours it'll be on Steam, and probably we'll have like a day one launch, you know, like 10, 20% off maybe, somewhere between there. So just make sure you check it out. Again, if you get this game, and it's not your type of game, and you played it for a little bit, and you're like, ah, I'm not feeling it. Remember, you have two hours to return a game on Steam if you're not feeling it. So if you like this, and you try it, and you're like, ah, eh, not quite my thing. I want to watch other people play it. Totally fine. Get your, get your money back, and uh, just enjoy the uh, little experience that you had. So, uh, yeah. So not the full version yet, but it will be today in just a little bit. And then we'll, we'll do a restart wherever we're at, and we'll do a full, full restart of the full game. Whee! No, I missed. There should be things in those leaf piles, I think. The point of no return welcomes you. <laughs> Driving the stagecoach is weird. <laughs> wow, this thing feels like you're hauling a trailer. Yo, Soupy Chowder, thanks for the eight months, and thank you very much for the three as well. Appreciate your support. All right, let's go. First combat. Hell yeah. So, can we change? No. Uh, let's see. Damn, that's cool. Yeah, the 2D art style is really cool here. Uh, the first game is really good. It gets uh, kind of loopy because you're moving through dungeons, but now they put you on a stagecoach out in kind of like an open world. Like, it feels like you're traveling the world, so it's pretty cool. All right. Oh, thank you very much, Eddie, for the two. It's very nice of you. Thank you very much. All right, let's go. A promising development. You die now. Ooh, nice. Oh, one thing I remember about this game, too, is that we got to worry about stress. That's one of the biggest things, because that carries over. Same with damage, but it seems like damage is a little easier to take care of. Uh, I've never played the first one. Can I get into this one easily? I think so, yeah. I think the first game's really good, and you should play the first game, but I don't think you need to. But the stories are kind of, like, linked, but... Yeah. I think you... Could, if you if, if you play and get this one and like it, go get the first game. It's usually on sale, like, all the time. Any big Steam sale. Let's try... Some Diablo sauce from Taco Bell. Go! Yeah! <laughs> Try that pistol. Excellent work. Good, good. All right. Got a bone to pick with that guy. Yeah, let's do another blinding or noxious gas. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. And let's crush. Oh, it's too far out of range. Uh, we got to hit her with a range attack. I'll just defend. Got you, bro. Pistol. <laughs> the work continues. Cool, we beat the game, guys. Awesome. Can't be any harder than that at all. the flame, burning brightly for all the world to see. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, loot! Ah. Relics and rural riches. Ow. Oh. Our first Are you dub. Shaken? There is so much worse in store. Oh, I know, sir. I know there's way worse out there.
Oh, is this a university? Lower your guard. Soften your gaze. It is safe here. Oh, is it? Oh, is it really safe here? Okay. All right. This is a store, basically. We have sixty-five relics. Maybe I'll scoot over here. There we go. We have 65 relics, 5 mastery, and 20 bubbles. Nice. Bubbles. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, we can buy upgrades for the stagecoach here. Regents to Mountain 3. The Resolute Companions reach the Torch and Crown. I think we can sell these for these. The end is where heroes can rest and recover between regions. Use the end to build positive relationships. Oh. <laughs> Oh, it's still early access. Sprite name, icon, mouse left to purchase an item. <laughs> yeah, again, this is the early access version. They're still buffing some out. Oh, the Wainwright, exactly. And those are all old, old things. I love how this game does give you, like, a ton of info, but you can choose to open it any time, and it's pretty much, like, no more than, like, a paragraph at the most. Love that. Because this game could be complicated, and it's not. I mean, it's organized nicely, so you can learn. Travel log, the provisioner, mastery trainer. The means of mastery. The next stop is leagues away. Plan accordingly. Mm-hmm. Shall we continue? Or is the lesson too demanding? Spend what you can. Oh, the yeah. wealth no longer has meaning. If indeed it ever did. So there's like a shop here. Twenty percent location and route scouting, sixty-five. Hmm. Storage trunk, more inventory slots. Oh. Bandages heals 10%. We could save some for those. So everyone starts out at level five. I want crisp. I want Bakos to be the, uh, you know, the shield basically, like to, the tank to take all the damage. Is there a way to defend more? Oh, we can upgrade that. Okay. But maybe that melee damage to crash. Is the voice actor the Transformers guy? Uh, no. But it sounds close. Let's hold the line. Oh, okay. Um, we'll do crash. Upgrade that one. Flashing daggers. Absinthe. Oh, it's a healing item as well. Uh, 
And I think I'm also going to increase the... Defense. Wait. I'm going to do knockback. Absinthe makes the heart grow fonder. Oh! Good one. Stitching kit. This is blocked by hemophilia. I, I don't know if that means we can't have it in the group or somebody just can't use it. What about the Wainwright? Does he have items for sale? Trophies are required to enter the mountain before uh, they're found by defeating lair bosses. Oh, we have to mount it onto the wagon. All right. Man, I really want to buy some of this stuff, but I feel like there'd be a better... Maybe we'll just save. Maybe there'll be better items later. Stress 1 out of 10. The first of many forks in the road. Mm. Choose your path and ride out unbowed. Oh, right. The maps are different, too. Like, we're in different biomes. There's, like, one that's on fire, one that's, like, a jungle. Uh, let's do the sprawl. Another nameless city. Another inferno of mutilation and madness. Damn, this guy is so good. The, the writing for this is just pinnacle, dude. It's like, it's really nice that they made a game around this, like, narration. You know what I mean? It's crazy. Yeah, there's always forks in the road, but no spoons, you know? I don't know why. Alright, let's go. I'll buy more stuff at the next shop. Hmm. Oh, maybe we should go back inside. This no, I, I think we took a wrong turn. This is definitely not. Yeah, this ain't Disney World. Oh boy. Oh, it's all on fire. That's cool. They must have added that. I don't remember that little cutscene where it shows you like what you're stepping into. Something to Palooza? The sprawl. Behold. The great cities of man. Ruined. And a flame. Okay, okay, oh, okay. Should I avoid that stuff? No. The burning pile. Oh, fanatics. Hi, guys. Oh, I see. So before the battle, we can make like a, a declaration or a statement and tie, tie bonds with people. We will overcome. Yeah, relationships between the heroes are important too. That's tough. Oh, this is great. A whipper. Flare, a moralist, and a lost soul. You die now. Nice. That'll make it so it's hard for them to hit us. Yep, yep, yep. Back up. 
Back of the line, pal. <laughs> Knock his ass all the way to the back. Oh, System Shock? Uh, I might play System Shock, yeah. I don't think I ever played the original, but I was aware of it and thought it was cool. I was like, ooh, shiny. Oh, nice. Not nice. In my face. Hey, sir, you need to step back. Ooh, here we go. Yep, finish him off, Tan. Let's go. Hell yeah. Double death. Great, now we got Typhoid. That's nice. Finish that enemy off. Bravo. Oh. I think this guy might be able to revive. We have to, like, destroy the graves. Oh, yeah. He's immune to damage. Hi. Knock your ass out. There we go. The work continues. Hmm. Yeah, the battle works like a card uh, card game, but it's like, you know, like side by side rather than like decks and stuff. But yeah, it's a really well done, a really cool system. We played a lot of card games on the channel before, too, and those are just damn good. I'm starting to enjoy these games more and more, and so are you guys, and it's good to see. I like it. Uh, let's see. Rough patch or unknown route? Then we we'll go. We can get two candles if we go right, and then go the middle route. Our once familiar kingdom, a stranger to itself. More burning piles. And more fanatics. Retreat. Oh, I thought we were going in for an attack. Oh. Consider all variables, but do it quickly. I thought we were going in for an attack. Oops. Our protection has been stripped to its last. Okay, maybe I'm supposed to avoid those? Thank you. 
I don't see health for the wagon. So twisted by despair. There we go. Let's do it. Immune to damage. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Bum, 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 bum. Hmm. Yeah. A speedy boy. There we go. Debuff? The hell? You're getting paid to watch me at work? Good. Good. All according to my evil plan. Yes, indeed. Oh, I thought it'd finish him. Yeah, the animations are really cool. I like them too. Let us hope to finish this quickly. resistant okay well that's not good uh, let's see blinding gas no and blight good Oh, good, even better. Not bad, five's pretty good.
There we go. That was close. Victory. Yours for the taking. Loot and booty. Miner's sharpness charm. Well, we better make sure we equip everybody now. We got a little bit of loot and booty. What's up, Vic? Uh. Hmm. Plus 10% damage. Oh, you can even change the roll. Oh, never mind, you can. Alter currency. Assistance encounter rewards flame, f food, and supply. So I can only heal people if we have stuff in the inventory now. I was hoping to use their ability for this. Unless I can. Okay. For the King? Yeah, I think... Isn't For the King 2 coming out? I'd, I'd like to play that. I know the original's out, but... Oh, you heal over time? Okay. That's good. Our group took a lot of damage towards the end there. Beep, beep. This new coach limping. Be prudent. You must be strong enough to shoulder more than your share of the burden. The desperate few. Help us. Let's ease their burden and inconvenience. Oh, I see. At the bottom, it shows us what will happen. Hmm. Hold alt. In items. Combat items. Flame and combat items. Kind of want the uh, knife tricks, really. Let's do some stuff for combat. A pouch of lye and milk-soaked linen. Oh, how lovely. Clear all corpses. Remove his blind. Thanks, folks, for the milk spilled linen. Really needed that. Thanks. Uh, we should probably go left. Ooh, cache of supply. Well, let's go right. Right. Left, because loot. Boss, and then an inn. Yeah. Let's 
nice to see all the decorations around, all the bodies hanging and all that stuff. It's nice. Ooh, an ambush. You must survive this onslaught short-handed. Once she had a sliver of decency. Now only greed. Oh, I see. They've ambushed our wet like the wagon broke down and we need to repair it. Okay. But we're being attacked while doing it. That's new. I don't remember seeing that. And if we attack row two and three, we get a damage boost for that, so that's good. An opportunity Aww. squandered. To. Oh, there's many more. There's many more wounds. My God. What? Bestows an uncertain absolution. This is a lot harder than I remember. Good. Challenging is good. Too easy and it's kind of a one and done. Oh, he took the hit.
That's good frontline damage. Oh, look at this the stress, too. You can't have a meltdown, you're dying. What's up, Flemish House? Welcome aboard. Every road must end. Well, a racetrack doesn't end. It just goes in a circle. That's not true, sir. She understood death, but could not defy it. And these boys do big damage. Fight through the fatigue. Burn, burn, burn. About time to die, boys. There it is. Dude, look at the flames in the background. That's so damn cool. An unforeseen complication. Yay, we died! Yeah! That, oh my god. <laughs> that was my shortest run ever. I remember the first time we got we really far. Deterred, and you will yet prevail. They made that a lot more challenging. Good. Oh, we got nine candles. A few more, we'll have an 80s movie. 16 candles, T. All right, let's go again. Yeah, we'll keep doing these warm-ups the until the full release later team. today. There's nothing at all. Since it'll be releasing soon. Perhaps the world was a dream. Ooh, Alter Vault. Even so, it is surely worth remembering. That's new. I don't remember that. Oh. Well, that's what you get with, you know, roguelike games, too, is you're supposed to die and then go back, buy upgrades and do it all again. Hmm. Hearts and minds will carry the day. Memory is the heart that warms the mind. Oh, trinkets, combat items, stagecoat item. Okay. We have what nine? Hmm. Give me a stagecoach item. Every twinkling recollection 
is another implement at our disposal. Increase the stacking for traps by two stack before each location chance to drop. Oh. Combat items. New instruments Ooh, healing will help self. us diagnose the world's affliction. That's a good one. And overcome it. A welcome advancement in the science of survival. Whittling tools, okay. De stresses, I guess. And a trinket. A drop of sanity in a sea of madness. Yes. The more they have to hold on to, the harder they will fight. Unlocks the filthy stagecoach skin. Unlocks a pet slot. What? We can have a pet? An orphan wolf cub. Oh, that seems really powerful. Hey, what's up, Huffy? Oh, there's also the Hellion, the Runaway, the Jester, uh, the Leper, Occultist, Vestal, and the Bounty Hunter. Boba Fett? He's in the game? Melee skills plus 10 critical. Oh. I like that flashing dagger skill. Alright. Let's go. Calls once more to its dark passenger. So it looked like another way to upgrade characters by default or whatever. Yeah, they made some changes since the last time I played. There's been, you know, a few updates. And that was not there the first time, and that is cool. Makes it more roguelike that way. No comfort awaits you here. Denial. You were denied, sir. You have cowered in your crumbling denial long enough. Let's go. Interminable faculty socials became something of a delight, knowing we'd abscond to a quiet table and lose ourselves in riveting discussion and passionate debate. More story. More lore. A crossroads. A beacon for the broken and the battered. All right. Let's see who we got now. Bomb. Hmm. <laughs> All right, last skin, and then hmm. Oh, thank God it fits. That is a very limited amount of characters they let you type in indiscriminate science stains the surgeon's hands it's like oh you could you could put a name in only two characters hidden valley ranch onward and let us hope enough yet remains of the world
Oh, it's the bridges of Madison County. How pretty. Yeah, Leskin. <laughs> That's one of our War Tales uh, shout-outs. Also, sorry about making you die to death. You see, even your valley is not immune to the spreading stain. Kill. Same with my cooking. Not really. Oh, we got five mastery now. Again. Graphics good. Push on to Game the good. Hidden. Rest and resupply await you. That's the mountain. Paramount Studios. We would come here in summers of years gone to write, think, and rest. They would do uh, Yelp reviews. can be taught that you may stand just a little taller at the end all right I'm gonna take that crush shoot um, pickaxe Only do one. Sag. Planning and mindfulness. As vital to survival as sharpened steel. <laughs> this guy's voice is so good. I want that guy to like do my voicemail message. Our great cities burn. All that beauty and knowledge ash on the wind yeah that's what I that's what that's what I wanted to be like you know, leave a message no no I want him to say that what he just did about ash and death oh right I have a stagecoach item thank you game Leaf suspension for the stagecoach means plus 4% positive relationship chance. Okay. You build relationships with people. I'm killing off chat. I know. I got plenty of you to go through. Don't worry. We'll get through everybody by the end of this stream, I'm sure. Hell yeah, brother. Got some whiskey. Negative two stress. Hell yeah, brother. Pipe weed. Ooh. Oh, it's an int. Well, I can use that anywhere. That's good. 
Oh, we keep our stuff from before? No way. Oh, okay. So it's an item everybody can use. Like that, okay. Alright. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> Levi, thanks to the five. Oh yeah, now they have different uh, things. Plus 10% melee damage and crit. Hmm. Hell yeah, brother, yeah. At this rate, I'll buy all the stress relief you got. There we go. Let's go with that. Okay, I think we're good. But I don't know what that is. Oh, it's a debuff. Okay. All right, let's go, brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks again, guys, for all the gift bombs this weekend. Thank you for all the super chats, memberships. Welcome to all the new subscribers. Thanks for hitting the like button. Hope you're all enjoying the stream. Welcome to the channel. Or welcome back again, if you're always here, like a lot of you, a lot of you. The sprawl. Behold, the great cities of man, ruined and aflame. Ooh, a shrine of reflection. Echoes of the past. Oh, I think this is where you have to, like... Isn't this the thing where you do a solo battle with them to get a skill? And they have to, like... F you kind of learn a little bit of their story? We're sending Red on a mission. This is where you kind of, like, learn a little Man bit about their arms. story. Chapter 1. A premature promotion. Yeah. This is really cool because each of the character classes have like a multi-part story that you can explore that kind of shows their background. So each of the characters aren't just a class. They're like their own per like their own person, even though each person is different. It's almost as if a class is a person, but they, you know, die often. Yeah, premature promota. What's up, Gabriel? Welcome back, the dude. The politics of a military career are... Perhaps as treacherous as war itself. Mm hmm. Though untested in combat, his acumen for advancement was unmatched. Through a dubious campaign of influence and intimidation, he had at last claimed a coveted command and was eager to bask in the glory of the victories that were sure to come.
None of those describe red at all. Uh, let's see. Ooh. Skill remembered. Oh, I thought we were able to fight, like, solo. Damn it. There was something where you could fight solo. Oh, well. At least it was still story-based. Uh, let's go to the watchtower. Eastbound and down, loaded up and trucking. Doing what they say can't be done. The value of such a view is matched only by its unsettling awfulness. Ooh, it reveals the whole map? Damn, that's really good at the start. Procrastination of the inevitable is futility itself. Oh, we can barter there. Uh, let's go left. We get one more candle and we can barter. Is your coat prepared for the upcoming obstruction? Probably not. Promota. Wheels is new. Coach limping. Be prudent. The Hoarder. Oh my god, he looks like the guy from Dark and Darker. The, uh, the, the Collector. My god. Ooh, a smoke bomb. Can we equip that now? Mmm. Mmm, slime mold. <laughs> a bear trap. Well, we made it uh, one hour and 19 minutes into the stream. Before we've entered enemy territory. That was a good run. And now it big bear begins. I mean, begins. Okay, uh, where's this guy? Alright, sir. Um, buy some more healing salve. Double. Ooh, a clotting poultice. Nice. How lovely. For each location, chance to produce poultice items. Hmm. Free items from that for 30. It's pretty good. I think we'll take that. I won't be able to install that, though, I don't think. Can I? I think we need the Wainwright in order to install that. But that was a pretty good price for an item that gives us free items. That's a good item. What else you got, pal? Mm. May as well. Thank you, sir. We're leaving. Huffy. Oh, grave robber. Ba -ba -ba. Hey, uh, hey, new to your channel, but love your content. I lurk because I don't have much to say. Oh, that's alright. 
Never be afraid to just say hi at the start of the stream. Sometimes I don't reply to you guys because, you know, I'm busy in a game or... I Honestly, sometimes I might not see, but chat will see, and so... It's not just you guys chatting with me. Sometimes people come into the chat and just say hi, and chat says hi back, and... It's pretty cool. Chat's pretty cool, I guess. Some of you. Some of you are cool. I don't know about Zion14365, though. I'm kidding. Welcome, dude. Is this Oregon Trail? All right. You know what? That's actually a very good... Um... Dude. Wow. Yeah. This is like a brutal version of Oregon Trail. You're, you're actually not wrong. Like, you're... You're plotting out a route, trying not to die. There's food. You can get attacked. <laughs> you can get attacked by a bear, probably. Yeah, yeah. This is this is just a super heavily modded Oregon Trail. <laughs> That's genius. Uh, is this from Steam? This will be on Steam in just a little bit. It comes out today on Steam. Right now, I'm playing the early access version on Epic, but in just a couple hours, uh, it full releases on Steam and full releases on Epic. So. It'll be on Steam for the first time, so it's brand new to Steam, and it's a new release, meaning it's exiting Early Access, and finally it becomes 1.0. So we're still playing the Early Access version, because they haven't dropped the full version yet, but, you know, I figured, hey, let's play now, and then as soon as it drops, we'll back out of the game, update to full version, and then play. Alright, where are we going? We want to go left, I think? We're here, so... Oh, we don't really have a choice. We have to pretty much stay left for the whole remaining route. Yep, okay. Yeah! 35 minutes it releases? Hell yeah. Hope everybody enjoys. Oh, we hit a roadblock. But if you, if you like card games, this is certainly like... Card games minus the card, you know? Like turn-based card games and stuff. This is really cool. If that's your type of thing, just add it to your wish list and check it out. Alright, sir, you're going to go ahead and die. And... You can die as well. Die in the face. And then... Oh, that's big damage. Stop it, sir. You are making me blush. Nice job. Let's get no! Not bad. You like the music in this game? Yeah, the sounds are great. I think the narrator... The narrator's voice is just... Man. It's like it was the perfect choice. I don't think they could have picked anybody better to do the narration. Uh, Raptor, if you made an RPG about watching paint dry, I'd give you a case of beer. And a rock I found in my yard. Well, that's good. What's up, Marcus? Well, I'm glad I can make some stuff entertaining for you guys. Uh, there, there is a lot of people I watch on Twitch and YouTube that play games. These folk have kept their honor. Uh, that I would never know how to play or really wouldn't want to take the... I, I enjoy them playing it more than I would learn playing it. Things like that exist. And that's kind of cool. Uh, let's see, we would earn food. What is that? Scouting. Flame and food minus. Well, we already know about the road ahead because we got the tower, so I'm just going to do the food. Oh, hell yeah. Slime mold. Hell yeah. Games are fun, yeah. You will 
fight so that others may flee. The fanatics feed themselves to the fire, their flesh melting like candle wax. Dear God. The burning pile. So blind them a little bit. Let's do it. Forty one health this guy has? Damn. Damn, that guy looks like a like a Resident Evil boss. He needs to die quickly. Hey, what's up, Floppy Sword? You feel like you need to take a four-year university program to play Dwarf Fortress? Yeah, and there's a new game coming out like Dwarf Fortress 2 called like Mountain Tales or Mountain Story or something like next week. Good to see more of those games. Uh, I'm really happy that graphics don't determine a game. Oftentimes, it's what makes a game unique. That does. Welcome to the stream. Oh, big damage! Damn, fifteen. Woo -hoo. Big damage. Wow, that guy like retreated to the back out of shame. Oh my god. Tawana, thank you very much for the seven months as a raptor egg. Damn, that, that is a big dub. Big dub for big damage. Let's keep hitting him. Gotta get big boy out of the way. Somebody drop a big O. Uh, someone drop some PayPal. Hmm. Oh, Dennis. Thank you very much for almost 20, bruh. Thank you very much, Dennis. All right, let's finish this guy. Boom. Let's make sure he's dead to death. No. Uh, hey, Raptor, it'd be cool if you made a summary every three to four months about the best RTS and RPG games you played so far. Emily, that 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 is a good idea. All right, Emil. I I think I want to start doing that uh, with. Games that I played, or games that I would recommend for like a Steam event or a Steam sale, because um, I seem to get the most amount of comments on a game uh, after a Steam sale drops, and then people will go into the comment section and, and then ask everybody what they think of the game. And so, like, you know, this game, Darkest Dungeon 2, you know, like a, a year or two after it comes out, it'll, you know, probably go on sale, and somebody will be waiting to get it when it goes on sale. And 
then they'll be wondering if it was a good one. So I think we should definitely do that. Quarterly recap, that's a good idea. Or just doing like a top ten. Maybe I'll do it via category. You know, like every three months I pick like the most amount of games that I played. Like, you know, top X city builders. And I, I don't think it's bad to include older games. You know, like if I say top ten survival games and mention Subnautica, which isn't like new or whatnot. But it's like some, some games are so good that like you have to put it on the list, you know. Um... But the good thing about those top tens is it's not really a top ten. It's more like a, hey, these are just ten really good games. And then mostly it's an area for the comment section for people to be like, dude, don't forget about this game. And it's like, oh, you're right. You're totally right. Top Roblox mods. Maybe we'll do Roblox. We'll get dirty in uh, Lumberjack and Roblox. We'll become the Roblox kings. It'll be great. <laughs> Sir, could you die? Thank you. Oh. I thought he would be dead by now. But yeah, it'd be a great idea to do a recap because I, I do put out a lot of videos because there are a lot of games and that'd be a great way for those of you who are interested in a particular genre. Like, if you like this game, we played uh, a game called... What was it? Mayo Kenshi. And I played another game called... Uh, damn it. There was one where we were in, uh, in a dungeon as well. There's a lot of card games that are like this. Either, either they have like an overworld map and then it's turn-based combat. But uh, coming up this week on the channel chat, we're going to take a look at a game called um, The Lamplighters League, which is like XCOM slash Indiana Jones. But it plays a little bit like... Do you guys remember when we played Showrunners? You know, it was like, it was like uh, The Running Man, but with uh, turn-based XCOM combat. It was, it was a good one. Uh, let's see. Now let's blind these two. A pox on you. That gives them a 50% chance to miss, so blinding is very powerful. I learned that now. You die now. Ooh, a miss. Nice. Sir, you're not allowed to do that. You can't hit me. That's illegal. Oh, this guy's being an absolute jerk. Kill that guy. There we go. The unrelenting application of violence yields morbid gains. Hmm. Yeah, too many great games. Too many. But it's a good problem to have. Extinguished at last. Four damage, not bad. Yeah, I think next we're going to summon a Pikachu. Yep. Let's see. A petty hindrance. You die now. Another impediment cleared with impunity. Uh, this game should should come out today in full. From what I've seen. I see a lot of people playing it today too because it's releasing on Steam and releasing in full 1.0. The loathing abates. So 
fumbling and grasping shadows of what they once were. Iritus, Lord of the Dead is pretty cool. Okay. I'll have to take a look at that one too. Big damage. Those attacks are really cool. I like that. I think that's pretty neat. You die now. Voice actor reminds you of the guy who does the voice for Stone Shard. What is Stone Shard? That sounds familiar. Is that a game? I love how he drags his mace on the ground and it makes that like clinking noise. Threats await those who dare. A minor anchoring charm. Uh, so far, how are we into the game at this point? Uh, this is not like our second run. We died the first time. Uh, but we're in like the first area. And we're getting closer to the end of the first area. So we're we're here. We need to go like one, two, three, four. Actually, we're, yeah, we're very close to the end. Oh, Stone Shard is like, uh, don't starve? Oh, that's cool. Don't don't star was cool. Uh, oh, we got a lot of stress here. Victoria be stressing. Can I, like, have a character use this? It says in item, so it might have to be used at the end. Oh, the uh, narrator's name is Wade June from the first game. Yeah. Yeah, the first... I can't hear this guy's voice without thinking, like, Darkest Dungeon. Like, if he ever did a cell phone commercial, if he did anything else, like a Ford truck commercial, I would just I just hear Darkest Dungeon. Like, imagine... Do, the reliability of a extendo cab down at the old construction site. All I would hear was, like, failure to rot, decay flames of the of a failed past like that's all i would hear <laughs> it isn't an item okay so i'll be able to use it there thanks chat and then i think we should give uh 
I will hold on to that. Can I hold... Can I do four? Can I stack those? Mm, oh, those are different. One's a burn salve. Salve. Savile. The academic's cash. Whoa. Damn. Woo. Wow. Big money masook in here. Thank you, Floppy Sword. Appreciate you dropping in. And or if you rated, because I wasn't sure, because you know YouTube. If you rated, thank you. If not, thanks for dropping in. Good to see you. We hit a roadblock. They seek to strike while we are vulnerable. Hold them off. Oh. Oh, you guys again. Nice dodge, bro. Woo! Cinnamon whiskey. Fireball, bad stuff. going very well. You're dead. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. is all it needs, he says. Meanwhile, the wagon's like tipped over. Oh, that's bad. Let's go with some more guns. There we go. Two down. Two to go.
Ooh, good. Yeah, hell yeah. One less obstacle in our path. Mm hmm. Got a little damage, but uh, nothing a little time at a Best Western won't solve. We are the flame, burning brightly for all the world to see. Bum, 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 bum. And we got some wheels. Oh my, dude, this is Oregon Trail. Like at this point, in at some point in the game, they need to have you like ford a river, or like um, I don't know. Like try to take a ferry crossing or something. Like get get enough money for a ferry crossing. We need a hunting mini game, a fishing mini game. <laughs> Oregon Dungeon Two. Yeah, dysentery. Well, one of our guys did have typhoid earlier, so. Neutral, neutral, unfriendly. Bro, we ain't leaving. Gotta take these guys down. Yeah, wagon tipping over as you're trying to cross the river. Yeah, it's like one of your characters just drowns. That's it. Oh, big boy again. Hi there. Wait a minute. He was blind anyway, he doesn't even have eyes. You love the original Darkest Dungeon, hope this one improves on the formula? Yeah, I think so. I hear a lot of people say that they've been enjoying it. As it's been out for a little while on Epic. But not a complete game, and I see some changes already that weren't in the original... Uh, you know, like the first 1.0, or whatever you want to call it, pre-release. <laughs> you guys can't hit me. Okay, you, you hit me. That's rude, sir. So far, so good? Yeah, it's, it's pretty good so far. Fifteen, fifteen. Well Ooh, done. twelve. Nice. All right, let's get rid of this nerd. This 
this doesn't do damage, does it? No. Cooperation is the key. The slow suffering begins. Oh boy. Uh, is this game moddable like the first Darkest Dungeon? Um, it might be on release. I'm not sure. Does anyone in chat know? Uh, never tried Darkest Dungeon. Should I start with the original one? I, I think you could play this one and get into it. it. It is a little different, but very, very, very similar. So if you played this one and you really like it, you could go back to the original. And I think whenever you do that, there's always kind of like a... Um, it does feel like you're stepping back, like a few features feel missing and things aren't as fleshed out when you go back to like a one, po like a previous game. But it doesn't mean that it's bad, you know? Because like devs, if they make a good sequel, it means that they've added two, you know what I mean? Like, I, I think I could say that about a lot of games where like the original's not as good as a sequel oftentimes, but um, that's a good thing. So yeah, D but Darkest Dungeon is like really cool. And it's dark and gritty like this and it's... It's just neat. It's just a neat game. Just super neat. Alright, sir, you're gonna have to die. Oh. I forgot he had a shield. Protected by the shaman. Oh, wait, he'll take damage then. Oh, this is good. Yes, good, good. Good, good. Oh, damn. Agony by accumulation. For who knows what lurks in the beyond. Damn the stress. There we go. Extinguished at last. Four, not too bad. Yeah. That's annoying. Yeah, but we got him. Ooh. Victory. Price of pride. Damn. You gonna grab some wings for lunch? You heading over to She Fox's house? Over encumbered. What? No, I have too much mana. Alright, I'll get rid of the smoke bomb. And the bear trap. Oblivion's Rampart. This will be fun.
Wow. These guys have no chill. Yeah, carry weight is a loot goblin's kryptonite. That is true, chat. Absolutely. Uh, does this game support gamepad? Uh, good question. I'm not sure. Uh, does the Steam Store page say anything about controller support? Oh, I dodged it. Captain Caveman with the eight months saying it's now out on Steam. It's cheaper on the Epic Store. All right, if you guys want to get this uh, on the Epic Game Store, use code Raptoria at checkout. But you know, so. Get it on Steam. Thank you guys for the support. Oh, the original game is on Game Pass? Oh. So the original Dark and Darkest Dungeon, almost said Dark and Darker, but Darkest Dungeon is on Game Pass. Cool. Well, maybe you give that a if you have Game Pass, give that a try, and if you like it, you can get this one too. Could be a good option. Rip and dip. Oh, a critical. That's a good one. Hell yeah, brother. Hell yeah. Let's go. And a death blow. All right, that shuts that one down. Thank goodness. One to two. Ooh. 
move. Oh no. Agony by accumulation. What? Seek redemption. We'll find it. That was challenging as hell. What's the meta progression like for this one? Well, it's um, a roguelite, so like, you know, for example, we just had a character die, but it's supposed to be, I mean, the game literally, <laughs> there's a splash screen that's like, this game's going to be hard and you're going to die and you're going to like it. And, uh, and they're not wrong. Foundation of trust. But it's a challenging one. A lot of RNG. The front one just won't die. Come on, kill it, man. There we go, finally, dude. Another impediment. Three the rounds with that impunity. one. chance to miss good okay good We didn't die to death. 20% <laughs> healing received from skills. Uh, well, we need that healing. Woo. Yeah, yeah. Unlocks and things are permanent. That's right, yeah. 
Uh, can blight finish an enemy? Yeah. Each turn, blight is kind of like po like kind of like a poison damage or bleeding. Ticks up each time. Candlelit windows promise refuge. Wow. We were almost to the hotel, too. But we made it. How's Darkest Dungeon 2 compared to the first one? A good improvement. Soften your gaze. It is safe here. I see two can use it. The means of mastery. Let's see. Oh, it's for trinkets. My bad. That goes there. Oh, don't we have a thing Planning to install? And mindfulness. As vital to survival as sharpened steel. Oh, we can only put only put one in at a time. But we can unlock more slots at the Altar of Hope. Okay, but we keep these items forever, so we can use it whenever. That's cool. Everywhere in ruin. Everywhere in need. The sluice, the shroud, or the tangle? Check the wheels. Uh Oh, I didn't know there was a thing for that. Oh, thank you. Repaired and refurbished. I see. Thank you very much. Ready for the leaps ahead. Okay, I didn't know that's So we could spend bubbles. <laughs> we could spend bubbles to get repairs. Okay. You won't survive either with three guys? Oh, for sure. Yeah, we won't. But like they make clear at the start of the game, you you ain't getting nowhere fast without a couple runs. Conventional fare, but fairly priced. Hmm. 
Save that for another day, maybe? I like how we're not we don't necessarily have money, but it's more like we're if we trade the charred books, it equals eighteen of that. Or whatever. Like we're not it's not really currency. It it equals a currency, but it's like an item that we're getting rid of. That's kinda cool. Yeah, getting wiped and starting over is standard in Rogue Galaxy, yeah. I mean Tarkov is like that, you know, where you could lose all your stuff out in the field and have to start with nothing. Dark and Darker is like that. Dome Keeper, uh, Wall World, all are like that. What's up, Iceman? Good to see you. Let's go through Booty Anti Commerce. Greater Wolf's Blood. Damn, I kind of want the the whole booty. I kind of have to go for the booty, because chat knows why. You know, we kind of just have to. Also, I'm 14 out of 20. Mm. Ceremonial drum... Oh, this is all in items. I'll buy that. Man, eh, we might find stuff on the road, too. All right. Mud and rain. Resignation and death. This land is truly barren. Barren? Alright, chat. You keep an eye on the party. And we'll head out in a minute. What? All these join emotes? Chat, are you trying to tell everyone in the chat to exclamation point join? No way. Alright, let's go. Yahar. Actually, this would be a good formula for a pirate game, too. Like our characters being pirates and the stagecoach being, um, you know, replace that with a pirate ship. Alright, so now we gotta go through the Netherlands. What? Suspicious! Muttered threats. 
All trust is lost. Hmm. Okay. Dude, that, that like loading into the biome thing is really cool. The Tangle. The Tangle. War. Rewards only. Resignation. Uh, resistance or assistance? I think we'll go right and see if we can get another candle. Yeah. Though decidedly inconvenient, at least we know what's coming. Looks like Darkest Dungeon had a baby with Slay the Spire. Oh, another good one. Slay the Spire for sure. Alright, they want help. Let's push them out of the mud. Uh, they... Wait, what's that? Oh, we get armor. Well, we already got that. Yeah, this game should be out now, so after this run, I think we'll uh, we'll do a restart after this run and update to the full release version of the game. We're still in the early access, but now that it came out today, it's, you know, we just got to update. Which will be Q. There, sir. Um, I would like you to die. The fiend's strength dwindles. Instead of caves, it's a medieval road trip. Yeah, basically, we're out of the dungeon and onto the roads. But I think the goal is to eventually reach a dungeon, and then maybe fight our way through that. I've never reached the end, so I don't know. I guess we'll see. Well, let's use these. Yeah, roads. I know, channel. A watchdog. Yeah, maybe the dog has a clock on him. A little help impeccably timed. You die now. Sorry, doggo. All right, just you now, sir. Measure out your violence and apply it judiciously. Comes 
rarely in these times. Savor it. Yeah. My streams get you so hungry. I know, I know. Well, we got our uh, raptor eggs here for only 99 pennies for 30 days, and you can get all the Wendy's you want, Dino Nugget emotes, and lots more snacks, and bears, which like to snack on me. So enjoy. Extinguished at last. I'm coming for you. Yes, I know. Only 99 pennies. That's a pack of gum, bro. Actually, I think gum is more expensive. Wrigley's, y'all. Cooperation is the key. Simple variable, easily resolved. Greater threats await those who dare. Cool. Another dub. Uh, is this worth it if you like the first one? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Um, apparently it's cheaper on Epic for, uh, for now too, so... I'm not sure what Epic store policy is, but I would imagine it's similar to Steam's where you can buy it, give it a little shot. If you really like it, then you you know, you can keep it and if you don't, just Sharpen ask for a refund. Blades, that we may properly excise our portion. Enter the den. A creature den. This is nice. Oh, well, that was a kill right off the to finish this quickly. Right off the bat. All right, not bad. Cleared with impunity. Necro Flagio. Oh, that's great. Nice. And so are we. Oh, Epic raised the price now too? Oh, probably for the full release, yeah. As soon as we die here, we'll uh, back out, update the game, and play like the full release version. Die. Damn right. Squandered. 
Messy. But what? Effective. More? And wanes. This wound at least has been tended to. Oh, good. Crash. We must crash. Yeah, the worms look big yikes, yep. Not looking good, boys. Sweat soaked brows, unsteady stances, exhaustion takes hold. can survive such a wholesale organic failure true that's true has anyone watched transformers rise of the beast no but uh that sounds cool i'd be interested in that they look like claymation oh yeah it's got a little claymation to it their idle animations and stuff are kind of cool Come on, Huffy. Gonna be a seven. Oh, an eight. Wow. And a four. Incremental, but deadly all the same. Oh. <laughs> all right, let's go again. We got more candles, though, so not bad. It's a win for progression. Damn, 10, 15, 18? Progress. Damn. 18. 
A nebulous nightmare. An apocalypse that only we can oppose. Oh, wait, wait. Uh, yeah, we should play the full release now. Ah, uh, means we're going to lose all of our progress. Ah, that's okay. Now, let's see the full release version. So... All right, we're exiting so we can update to the full version of the game now that that's out. Stand by. Okay. It'll just be uno momento. There we go. Now again, uh, we're playing on Epic since I got it on Epic a long time ago when it was early access, but now this is also new. On, it, this hasn't been on Steam before. So if you got it on Epic, your game is updated to 1.0. If you buy it on Steam, you get the 1.0 as well. Which is Q. So Redemption Road was update 9. Wow, they've updated this game 9 times since its initial launch. I guess you could say release or, well, launch, full launch. All right, let's go. Let's take our first look at the full game now. See what's changed. Hell yeah, brother. Let's go. This pleases me as well. I am also pleased. This pleases me. Lol. All right, let's go. Unable to load file. All right, so we have to restart from zero. So we've lost all of our progress with the candles and things like that. But that system, remember, the candles are what we can spend to make the whole game easier. So the first couple of runs are going to be real hard and you're just going to die, you know. So. Let's go. Your sanctum. Adrift in this bituminous nightmare. All right, so now it's a fresh new 1.0 game, as if we've never played it before. Denial. You have cowered in your crumbling denial long enough. Commonalities between the mythos of ancient cultures was not a new area of study for either of us. But it was there that we first noticed the pattern. Flannel? The crossroads. Wait by the lantern's light and welcome what help may come. Ooh. All right. Indiscriminate science stains the surgeon's hands. Okay, let's go with some newbies. Maurice. Uh, let's see. Oh, they made it so you can add more characters. Oh, they, they made it so you can make the names longer. Okay. Well, that's one good update. We would have never fit that name before. All right. Nerdapalooza, you're in. Maurice, you're in. Got to get another name. Who else we got in the chat? John Pocalypse. <laughs> it's a great, like, superhero. I like a 
action hero name. And good for this guy with guns. Oh, I can only fit that. You're John Pockley. And we'll go with Lola Girl. There we go. All right. Thanks for watching the stream, guys. I'm I'm throwing random people's names into into the uh, game. So whenever we come up to that uh, character screen, which we'll be back here, by the way, we're gonna we're gonna die. So when we get back to that screen, just put a one in the chat, and I'll I'll try to pick your names. The leaves fall. Never to grow again. Oh, you can make the wagon go slower. I didn't know that. You can feel it. A change in the air. Is that love? Love is in the air? Diffuse, thank you very much for the five bomb for chat. Thanks for gifting five you memberships. See, even your valley is not immune to the spreading stain. What got stained? Sue spray and wash, dude. Oh man, it's gonna be a tough battle. Oh, let's see. Um, uh, hmm. what's up, Maurice? Thanks for the five. Thanks for making me an angry bird. Yeah, you do. You do kind of look a little irritated. <laughs> Democracy. Ugh. Desperate grab. Hands to yourself, ma'am. Thanks again, Maurice. DNX for making me an angry bird. Oh, right. Yeah, fi five or more for the text to speech if you want to send a message. Tee hee. In your face, ma'am. Ew. Bafflement and vexation. You die. One less obstacle in our path. Oh wait, they changed it from like a little oh they changed it from a little gravestone to a corpse now, or is that a different mechanic? Oops. Take that corpses. That must be the new gravestone. Yep. A minor sacrificial host. Oh, that's nice. Great way to start. Are you shaken? No. There is so much worse in store. I know. The place is a little worse for wear, but familiar nonetheless. means of mastery got to take the ones I like using the most
the next stop is leagues away. Plan accordingly. So then if we had con continued our game from the last run, then we would have had like, all that stuff for the wagon. Spend what you can, for wealth no longer has meaning. If indeed it ever did. to buy healing items for sure. More healing and less damage. Hmm. Wait a minute. Isn't this morphine? Somebody in chat told us about uh, a lot of them. Minor heat shield. Well, this would be good. We can raise everybody's max health here. Let's do that first. All right, that that mold has got to be like a a must must buy. Oh, it's opium. Oh, okay. I thought it was morphine. That well, shows what I know. Uh, let's see. Resistance to blight, but less resistance to bleed. All right, let's make our healer Maurice. No. There, that one. Yeah, the, uh, yeah, the chat. That's right. The more, the more you know. Uh, where's that one? Yep. That's right. I think we could save some for the next shop. And let's go. Consider your position and plan accordingly. Oh, we get five candles for this one. Well, we're probably going to die, so let's go this way. Goal, avoid the field hospital. 33% more flame drain. Mud and rain, resignation and death. This land is truly barren. Man, this guy has like a thousand quotes. The tangle. Let's go. War. Rewards only. Resignation. All right, we're going. Wagon damage. Wagon damage. Candle. Barricade. All right, I think we're gonna go middle. Skirt.
Seven damage. Excellent work. Damn straight. It's good. This game would be good for a phone or uh, <coughs> tablet or the Steam Deck. Does anyone in the chat have a Steam Deck and use it all the time? Yeah, get crushed. Hills dang, you use it? Okay. Oh, four. Oh. Move that bleed. Damage. You love your Steam Deck? Okay. Yeah, I want to get one to play ga games like this. I feel like I should do a video on, like, a bunch of Steam Deck games that are cool, but I'm going to have to, like, first get a Steam Deck and then be... Specifically, buy games to play them only on the Steam Deck. Like Roots of Pacha would be good. Stardew Valley, this game. You use your Steam Deck to play PS1, 2, and 3 games? Oh, really? A righteous action. Sir, are you sure you want to die? That was a low blow, sir. Scavenge what you can and be off once more. They should give me a Steam Deck? Well, I'll buy one. Been out for a little while, you know, so the support is probably even better than day one and I think a ton of games were already ready for Steam Deck day one anyway. Pity a soul so twisted by despair. The Forgotten Outpost. Oh yeah, I forgot this was here. That's why it's the Forgotten Outpost. What is this? The Lost Battal The Lost Battalion. The Battalion. Oh, we're not leaving, so let's get into combat. I want to fight. Even if it means our death. Wow, you're a big boy. Woo. Hi there. The woodsman. Uh-huh. I see that. Yeah, they got a drummer. I guess we'll get rid of him too. Wow. Whoa, a crossbow? Turn off. There we go. This 
is no time Whoa. to falter. Wow. Big damage. A master stroke. There we go. Wow, he's got a. F oh, dude, cool. So instead of them being generic little gravestones now, they've got like a little. Uh, like a little sprite or whatnot for each of the dead characters. That's awesome, dude. That's so cool. I like that. Ooh, that crossbow was mean. Cut down these nightmares and blaze the trail to your redemption. Hell yeah, brother. Rip and dip. It'll be a four wheel track all the way to redemption. Well fought, I agree. A roadblock. Uh, let's see. Evils overtaking the world shown by the loathing meter. Higher loathing results in tougher conditions for the party. Oh. The loathing whispers. Rummage through the shelves. Laden with echoes of indistinct ideas. Combat items or a trinket? Let's go with trinket. Amidst the spoils, an artifact of unparalleled power. Plus 25 healing received from skills. That's good. Wait, does that change his appearance at all? No. You love your Steam Deck? Oh, good. Oh, where are we going? We're supposed to avoid a field hospital in this mission. Wait. We're supposed to visit a field hospital. Wait, where's I thought we were supposed to avoid one. Oh. If we avoid the field hospital, we get five candles. But if we visit a field hospital, we get two. So I guess we'll have to avoid it. Uh, boss fight. Ooh, let's do that. Let's go to the lair. Brace up. There is danger on this path. But the doctor does the healing, doesn't usually receive it. I thought that was for... Hold on, let's check. The loathing festers. Wasn't that for healing done? Oh, healing received. Ah, uh, thank you. Well, then we'll give that to probably the front line. You're right. So the only thing it does is gives gives him greater healing if he is healed. Okay. I thought it was armor to heal better. It is, but it's more like to receive a better heal. But only from a skill, not from an item. 
The General's Keep. Within every keep, a general and his loyal lumbering guard. Oh, great, a lot of annoying ass drumming. Alright, the drummer's gotta go first. One. Have I noticed any other changes to the full game besides the updated core sprites? Um, not so far, but to be to be honest, I haven't played this game too much. But uh, I've noticed a lot of the updates since I last played. So that's good. Yeah, we're going back there. We need to get that damn drummer out of the way. Jeez, man. Come on. Double. Oh, my God. Oh, let's poison him. I uh, didn't poison him. This is what no the time to falter. Wow. Nothing they weren't messing around. Such a wholesale organic failure. They were just triple spam attacking. Tried to get rid of the drummer, but it was like they shielded and then triple attacked. That's lame. Yeah, well. Drum, immune to damage. Damage immunity. Yay! Don't make me turn this coach around. Drummer's gotta go first. Spam, spam, spam. Messy, but effective. Last, the battlefield has claimed its due. A drum beat killed that guy. Okay. Stupendous. Nice. Good.
Uh, there we go. Killer music. Yeah. Killer indeed. Oh, should we escape or advance? Uh, let's just escape. When myriad variables align themselves against you, it is wise to desist. Hero remains. Deliver to the inn to gain four candles. Oh, we could bring our dead with us in order to... If we get to the end, we get a bonus for it. Oh, that's kind of cool. Alright, so even though our characters died, we can, like, get something for it. That's pretty stupendous. Stupendous indeed. Alright. Retreat is always an option. True. But then it would raise stress or something, probably, and then someone's going to have a meltdown during a mandatory battle, and then they're going to die anyway. Your path lies through them, and so they must fall. A forgotten outpost? Fog. These two want to fight. Oh, no drummer this time? Oh, God. Two crossbowmen? Dear God. It's over. A brilliant conclusion. Agony by accumulation. Yep. There's a lot of agony, that's for sure. You die. To the shadows for the last time. They're shooting crossbows at the grave. There we go, we got one. This is no time to falter. Yo, uh, uh, Lee L, thanks for the six months as a raptor, a little raptor. Thank you very much for the support. That's awesome. Thank you. Steady yourself. You die on me. Well, well, too late. Perhaps they have given their last. Every road Boop. must end. <laughs> That's the end of that run. On to another one. Yeah, the, anima uh, the animations are really cool. Oh, damn. If only we would have gotten to that inn, though. We could have gotten f eight more, I think. Plus whatever we could have gotten for completing it. But remember, that that was our first one. So that's supposed to be the most challenging. Or at least you make the least least amount of uh, progress. And sprawling. This hellish abyss extends beyond sanity itself. I didn't really play the first game. I know of it and played it. I mean, I played it a little bit, but, or I saw somebody play it, 
but I don't really know much uh, from that game. I played more of this one. Alright, let's upgrade some stuff. These are beaten, oh, it saved our stuff from the soldiers. previous run. And yet our fortunes ride with them. Uh, Mr. Ifo, thank you very much for the five. Appreciate it. Now well, let's get these two basic up upgrades. Oh, we got a lot of candles to spend. Damn. Can we unlock the Hellion? Oh, we could unlock the Hellion. Oh, let's unlock a new class. Hellion. Yeah, we've unlocked Hellion now. Cool. Hellion. Hellion, brother. And Boba Fett. Bounty Hunter can sometimes be hired at the end. So this just makes them more resistant to death. A little more light, a little more strength. The true splendor of a world, those who live within it. Melee skill plus 10 crit. Wow, uh, that's okay. I like the flashing daggers. The more they have to hold on to, the harder they will fight. No, oh, I guess it did save some. It saved the the progress that we made in the last run, then, but just not the the items or the characters, obviously. Hearts and minds will carry the day. Yes, yes, they will. Uh. Wow, what a character that guy is. I think I'm going to save some Remember, candles till I play a little bit more and then learn what I want to go. Mind. Get the healer. Which one's the healer? We have the uh, Plague have Doctor's the healer. And failure. In ample portion. I'm gonna save some uh, candles, I think. Wisdom will help you choose a path. Or wait a minute. Resourcefulness will ensure you survive it. Arriving at the valley and we get plus twelve relics and bubbles. Well oh, that's a good one. The occultist? Okay, maybe we'll pick him next. And let's do more inventory slots. Hail the vessel of your deliverance. Yes, because of uh, once more into the maelstrom. All right, we'll save. In search of what hope Save some candles. Remains. Let's go, brother. Face your failures, or be consumed by them. You guys think we should unlock the Vestal next? Okay, let's unlock them after this run. We'll go for a healer and change to that one. It's a good idea. The shackles of denial must be destroyed. Now we gotta get to that uh, crossroads. All right, let's go. Give me a hell yeah! Give me a hell yeah. We spent long nights immersed in crumbling, worm-eaten volumes, plumbing the forbidden secrets of antiquity. The crossroads. 
where lost souls hope to find their way. Hey, there's our Hellion. Hellion, brother. High damage, bleed, and bloodlust. If it bleeds, kill it. Mr. Ifo with the 10. Thank you very much for the uh, continued support. Thank you. Beneath bloodlust and fury, there is emptiness and shame. All right, we're going to go with these ones this time. We're going to skip out on the uh, highwayman. Although he wasn't too bad either. All right, let's name some stuff after our members. Let's go. Or whomever may be in the chat. The man at arms upgrade for bolster is a very good way to mitigate stress. Oh, good. Oh, yeah, I did see that. But I haven't done it yet. But yes, you are right. Hmm. You just bought your friend this game? Good. Good. Sir Tokes. Freya. Alexander Schilling. Can't fit the full name, but... And... More. I need more. You forgot it was releasing today, you're about to download it. Yeah, if you have uh, Darkest Dungeon 2, all you have to do is update it on Steam or Epic for the 1.0 release, or just if you re download it, it'll just be automatic. And then you'll have the updated version. Alright, let's go. Oops. science stains the surgeon's hands. Avarice slips unseen into the catacombs of the mind. Cool thing is you can change the names anytime you want, which is cool. The Valley. now into the crumbling chaos of the world true you can feel it a change in the air the bulwark of your denial is giving way oh starting off with a big boy that's nice. Protect the child. He has like a little toy stuffed bear on his chest. Great.
Good, he comes forward to protect. Cooperation is the key. Get out of here, sir. Biting me like that? Combo combo, hell yeah. Death blow. There we go, 50% chance to miss. Good damage. There we go. Oh, there's a 1.8 the gig update for Redfall. Yields. Morbid games. Redfall was alright. I was enjoying it. Since we've been playing a lot of Generation Zero. Straightforward. And effective. A victory. Push on to the inn. Rest and resupply await you. the mountain. The place is a little worse for wear, but familiar nonetheless. Hmm. Precious relics remind us of a time before the end. Something to ease the rigors of the road. Self heal twenty when targeting uh, the the Scully boy. provisions do we got? Stress is definitely going to be a thing. But we might actually find um, oh look at that plus look at that plus 20% traveling heal that would be so good dude. Oh. 
If only we could get that. That'd be great. until we get to the next area. We'll see. The first of many forks in the road. Choose your path and ride out unbowed. Big game. Foreclosure notice. Damn. Trenches and tents. The front lines of a war that was never fought. Let's go, brother. Yeah. What's up, colonists? Welcome, everybody. Good to see you all here. Hope you're enjoying Darkest Dungeon so far. Tan Glee. War. Rewards only. Resignation. Hmm. Avoid the hoarder. We're supposed to visit two assistant encounters. Let's look for a tower then first. So buy an Epic, not Steam. Uh, the choice is yours. If you get it on Epic, you can use code Raptoria at checkout. And there may be a discount there, and it might be the same with Steam. So it's really wherever you prefer to play. Alright, so there's a barricade, then a lair. Then a barricade, and an assistance encounter. Oh, there you go. Continue hero's story. Alright, let's go here first. Do the things you run over with the wagon provide anything? I think so, but I can't tell like what's happening or what I'm getting. I think we get a little bit of money or something every once in a while. It's random, I think. Yo. Oh. Great. A group of fun individuals direct nice starting off strong Steady yourself. Damage.
<laughs> wow. Damn, she's strong. Yep. She's a strong one. Oh, the General's Keep. How great. Love the General's Keep. So awesome. Can't wait to see what they keep in there. Death. That's what they keep in there. D E T H. Death. Within oh, great. Keep the Dan. No, General not this guy again. Loyal lumbering guard. No. We gotta kill the drummer first. He's gotta die. Oh, you used my link to get this game? Thanks, dude. I hope you enjoy. It's been pretty fun so far. Both times I played have been a good time. You die. Collaboration confers advantage. There we go. I was already blocking. Die, damn it.
Two down, two down, we're good. Well, little drummer boy. That's what I thought. I think we're going to escape. I'm not getting too greedy. Bye. Yeah, we did it. All right, that was much better. Damn. Recognize your disadvantage and accept it. Yep. That's true. I'm out. Yeah, let's get on the road. Flame sputters. You must give hope to get it. Ooh. Oh, just two of you guys? All right. Death party of two. Done. Got to use that bolster. Get that stress down. Is there much improvement to this game? Oh, yeah. Yeah, on the first... Much better than the first game, and also... Um, a lot of good updates since since it first came out. The Desperate Few. Bright light's important. Yeah, let's do a hero story. Look ahead. A place to reflect, remember, and reconcile. Yeah, now our card has five wheels. That's right, Chad. Shrine of Reflection. Let's do it for, um... Hellion. Hellion. Chapter 1. The Eve of Glory. Okay. She was young to join the war band. But any who challenged her readiness were met with clenched fists and violent indignation. Having bloodied the last of her detractors, the matter was considered finally settled. On the eve of battle, she joined her clanmates in a raucous celebration, her stein and her spirits overflowing with abundance. Okay.
Soupy Chowder with the two. Saying new. You will fight so that others may flee. Thank you very much for the two. These seasoned soldiers were deployed to a winding front meant to prevent the cult's descent from the mountain. Down and Nuggets in the chat, show them some love. I think we should probably GTFO after the last battle. But... Nah, we're going in. Oh good, no drummer. She's holding nicely. Bravo. Damn, nice. This road cannot be walked alone. Got him with the revive. A lesson taught is a lesson learned. Uh, all right, let's get that guy. Oh, there we go. Oh, wow, I already brought him down to death's door. All right, it's not going to be that bad after all. to finish off the corpses then. Do everything we can to sm smash. There we go. Well done. Ooh, second time, damn. Smash the corpse up. 
sweat-soaked brows, unsteady stances. Exhaustion takes hold. <sighs> Alethea, thank you very much for the uh, four months as a little raptor. Thank you very much Remember, for the support. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks for the support. Alright, good. Now we can finish these two off. Getting all annoying. That wasn't too bad. The drum is the worst combo. Damn straight. Yeah, there we go. Abandoned or forgotten. It is ours now. No, it's mine. Oh. The loathing abates. Simple choice. Ooh, I'm going for the supplies. At least it should be. Nope. Oh, and we completed a hero goal. This way, if you can make it. Glimmer of hope, field hospital, or assistance encounter. I didn't miss one, did I? There was one there. Oh, wait, that's resistance encounter. They want us to go to an assistance encounter. The Wainwright awaits. Eager oh, to this was trade. much better. Nice. Is that the same narrator as Civ 6? I don't think so. Each hero on combat starts. Oh, matters. Is the flickering torch you bear? And we have to install... <clears throat> oh, we have the medical equipment. We do. Oh, damn. We have to install that at a... Uh, oh, wow, we found medical equipment. No freaking way, dude. Okay. So we just got to get through this encounter, then a boss, then we get to the end, and then we can install it. And that's going to be huge. We get a plus 20% heal on the move, which is big. Gargantuan. Yeah. <sighs> Oh, it's got to deal with doggos this time. Oh, the dog counterattacks? Maybe on a defense mode. All right. No, that wasn't compassion. That was that was literally drugs. Oh, get wrecked. No, bad kid. No, it's not a kitty, Chaz. It's a, ba it's a bad dog. No, it's not a kitty. It's a watchdog with a death howl. 
slow down. Suffering begins. Messy. Yeah. But effective. Quite. This wound, at least, has been tended to. A simple kindness. Oh yeah, Sean, did Sean Bean do the uh, voiceover for Civ? The boss battle, frickin' boss battle, brother, brother, boss, boss battle, yeah. Never mind, I regret this. Nope, never mind, no way. Not that bad. Everyone just needs to die quickly. Starting with you. Oh yeah, they could probably add characters after a little while. I didn't I don't know if they added any new characters for full release, but it'd be pretty cool if they did. Damage pretty good. Oof. Not escaping that. Time to die. Almost done, brother, yeah. Got 
Got him. Bravo. Nice. Very good. That should be a death blow. Yep. And then, time for you. Cheeks clapped. An inkling of potency still lingers in some of these well-worn relics. Yes. The loathing abates. Time to go to the end. Let's go. Great game, I agree. It be a great game indeed. The familiar hearth crackles invitingly once again. Indeed it does. Indeed it does, sir. Oh, and we got the foreclosure notice. Everybody just chilling. Guys, I want to come back and play more Darkest Dungeon 2. It's dark, it's gritty, and I like it a lot. And it's out now on Steam and also the Epic Game Store. Use code Raptoria at checkout on the Epic Game Store if you want to get it there. Otherwise, it's on Steam as well. Full release. No longer early access. Out today. Out now for everybody. Uh, we're going to go live now to a new game I think you'll all like. If you like uh, Darkest Dungeon, there's a very dark and gritty city builder coming out soon called Gord. We're going to take our first look at some gameplay for Gord where you can build your own city, defenses. It's essentially like uh, parts of maybe Frozenheim and a little bit of Frostpunk and like uh, Baba Yaga, you know, Slavic lore and, and uh, myth mysticism all put together. It's pretty cool. So we're going to take a look at that and I'll see you all in our next stream a little bit later today. We'll take our look at Void Train as well before it comes out tomorrow. So there's a lot of new releases this week too. So I'll see you all in that video. We're going to go live right now. So just stay here in the chat and we'll go check out that new uh, builder right now together. Thank you very much for being here. Hope you all enjoyed the uh, stream. Don't forget to smash like. And let's jump over to a brand new video on the channel. Thanks for joining me, chat. You guys are awesome. Let's go.